You and Your Young Child, a program of information and services available for you and your child from prenatal to age five. You and Your Young Child has been brought to you in part by Sternberg Museum of Natural History, also by The Dentist. Fort Hayes State University's Sternberg Museum of Natural History invites you to experience Bringing Fossils to Life, their newest permanent exhibit under the dome. Meet a giant mosasaur and its living little relative, the Australian Water Monitor. Learn about evolutionary stasis with giant tortoises and discover the many ways fish made their way onto land with mudskippers. Experience all this and more at Fort Hayes State University's Sternberg Museum of Natural History in Hayes, Kansas. Discovery. Come discover a one-of-a-kind dental center for the whole family at The Dentist. Dr. Melinda Miner and Dr. Michael Holmberg and their warm and friendly staff love working with children of all ages to help keep everyone smile happy and healthy. They recommend children start seeing the dentist by age one. The Dentist is now accepting new patients, children, and their families. Visit them at 1010 Downing Avenue in Hayes or online at thedentistinhayes.com. Hello, and welcome to You and Your Young Child, the program devoted to early childhood. My name is Dana Stanton, and I'm the coordinator of early childhood grants for USD 489. And with me today is Marla Bauman. Good morning, Marla. Good morning, Dana. Now, first of all, tell us what organization you work for and what do you do there? I work for St. Francis Community Services, mm -hmm. and my job there is to recruit foster homes for all the foster children in Northwest Kansas. Okay. Now, today we're going to talk about some specific things. The first thing on our list is the CARE Portal. So tell us about the CARE Portal. Well, uh, Dana, would you check your inbox if for a child in need? Um, I haven't thought about it, but I guess I could. <laughs> okay. If an email was a doorway to you being the hands and feet of Christ to a hurting child or family in your community, would you open it? Well, of course. Okay. Currently, there's no fast and effective way for child welfare workers to connect with the local churches about mm -hmm. this. And so uh, the Care Portal is helping us do that. Mm -hmm. um, so how does that, now tell us, how does that work? How does the Care Portal work? Okay, uh, part of the Care Portal is an online church engagement tool mm -hmm. that connects child welfare workers to the church. Mm -hmm. And so when a child welfare worker identifies a family that has a need, like um, maybe it's a foster family that needs a crib because they're getting a baby, okay. or um, some other thing. Um, one time I heard of like a family needing an uh, air conditioner. And um, so then, uh, they the the worker knows of the need. Mm -hmm. They contact um, the care portal online and submit the request for help. Mm -hmm. And the care portal quickly sends out an email to uh, the contact person in the churches to let and, them know this is our need. Yeah, this mm -hmm. is our need, mm -hmm. and uh, so that goes out to the community. And then the church answers the call. And it's, it's just been amazing how it's been working. We don't have the care portal yet in Hayes, but we have it going in Great Bend now. Mm -hmm. And um, it's just amazing how fast that how these... How fast these needs can be met. Yes. Well, I great. imagine there's lots of people who want to help but aren't exactly sure how. And this would give them a very specific way that they could help and fill a very specific need. Exactly. Mm -hmm. And, you know, not everybody can be foster parents, but they still would like to help. Mm -hmm. So this is a great way that mm -hmm. they can do that. So tell us about the process. What is the process for this? Okay. Um, the local churches identify a volunteer coordinator to act as a liaison with the Care Portal team. And then the coordinator identifies key agency partners, which would be like St. Francis, mm -hmm. um, to uh, roll out the care portal. And then um, we get the, we start enrolling the churches. Um, like there's different, um, I think that we need 10 churches in an area in order to get it going. To get it started. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So um, the care portal team activates a system for the county and the agency workers submit via the air portal the enrolled churches respond to the need and then it just, that's the way it works. And it goes from there. Yes. So when did this first start? Uh, it started in March 1st of 2015 is when they started. And um, it's, you know, it's just, it's really, really done good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, how many churches are involved so far for the whole program? 
Well, there's 831 churches mm -hmm. uh, that have already impacted over 4,715 children in nine different states. Mm -hmm. So we're not, there's not up and running in Hayes yet, but what if someone like local churches or people that are watching this say, hey, I want to learn more about this and maybe my church could help out. What would they do? Uh, they can go to thecareportal.com mm -hmm. and it tells you how to uh, get enrolled. Um, Holly Cable, she is the field manager for Kansas here. Mm -hmm. And uh, so you can email Holly at goproject.org mm -hmm. um, and her phone number is 620 Two hundred sixteen fifty nine. Okay, and we'll put that information on the bottom of the screen. Okay. Now, finally, I know there's some special events coming up. So there, tell us about that. There is. We have an, a special event coming up in Great Bend, mm -hmm. um, and we're hoping that maybe uh, we can do this in Hayes also after the first of the year. Mm -hmm. But uh, St. Francis, along with DCF, will be hosting a free, open to the public, strongman show. Okay. At the Assembly of God Church in Great Bend at 6.30 on October 26th. Mm -hmm. uh, it will feature Bubba Dowling, who is a motivational speaker and an entertainer, husband and father. Mm -hmm. uh, Bubba will be demonstrating his strength as he shares his story about becoming a world famous strongman. Okay, so it's a family event, something that's good for the whole yes, family? Yes, it's gonna be great for the whole family. Mm -hmm. So Bubba has been a foster parent, an adopted parent, and he shares his story uh, mm -hmm. while he's doing the strongman show. And I'm really looking forward to it. I think it'll be a great mm -hmm. entertainment for the agency and for everybody who comes. Mm -hmm. So Now if someone wants more information about that, how do they contact? Um, they can contact me, 785-476-8501. Uh, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. That would be great. Well, so. That sounds like a wonderful event that's good, good for the whole family and also the care portal. Um, you know, I really encourage our viewers out there, if you maybe belong to a church that could participate, that sounds like a great way to help um, some kids and to have some needs and some families. It yeah. certainly is and we look forward to to working with those churches. Mm -hmm. Well, thank so. you so much today, Marla. Thank you. Mm -hmm. You've been watching You and Your Young Child, the program devoted to early childhood. Parents remember, you are your child's first and best teacher. Thank you. You and Your Young Child, a program of information and services available for you and your child from prenatal to age five. You and Your Young Child has been brought to you in part by Sternberg Museum of Natural History, also by The Dentist.